What's up, guys? So, we're building a bag of stuff that goes in your car for uses in your car and for, like, emergency, get out of the area or place or whatever, get home, whatever bag. So, I'm just going to start building this thing out. So, already, of course, you guys know me. I already built out the tools. First thing that had to be built was the tools. Um, so, yeah, let's get into it. Let's see what kind of tools I'm going to be carrying with me all the time. In my car, at least. Yeah. I'm making an, yeah, an EC bag, but I'm making a bag that also goes in my car. That was kind of weird. Hold on. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, we're making a bag that goes in my car. That I can take with me if I need to. Or have more stuff if I need to. I don't know. Let's get into it. Hey, we're, we're doing the tools. Anyways, let's do it. Let's get into it. Cue the end. Three, two, one. Zero. 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 And lift off. All right. So basically, I got this bag that we're going to keep in my car, okay? Uh, plenty of pockets, got some water pockets, got some, like, storage up here. Got plenty of storage in there. The first thing I'm totally going to put in this thing, this is an emergency um, survival blanket. Um, everyone tells you to keep a blanket in your car, but I didn't want, like, a huge blanket in my car or whatever. This thing is, like, very small, but, like, Pops out to be big. You could like build a tent with these things, keep warm with these things, cover up anything. You kind of flash people, you know, like uh, an emergency situation, you know, all sorts of stuff with this. So, this is gonna be like the first thing I put in here. I'm gonna shove it right here, right there. But that's not what we're doing today. We're doing the tools that I'm keeping this bag that I'm gonna keep in my car. So. You guys have already seen the little tool pack for the EDC that I made. That's just going to come with me everywhere. I'm going to make a backpack that I just take everywhere. But this is going to be in my car. Like, you know, in my personal car. Like, anytime we may go on vacation, put it in whatever car. So I have access to even more tools. Even more survival stuff. You know, maybe some, like, you know, first aid kits, stuff like that, you know. So, let's get into it. So, basically, I started gathering. I had this pouch, but I hated the way, like, you picked it up and it went, like, like you looked at it and, like, you hear the tools, like, hated that. So, started gathering pouches. And this thing, like, reduces so much freaking noise. Okay. So, that's empty. Let's get into it. I'll do these right here. So these are um, all different sockets and wrenches. Um, like this is, I have metric and standard. That's why they are both different. I have blue over here and yellow over here. And these are for the sockets for the different kinds. So like three eighths, one fourth, and um, half inch. So, these things were a dollar at Walmart. Um, these tool pouches, these things fit perfectly. But yeah, I have bought all the sockets and the, the wrenches. So, for both metric and standard. So, I don't need to pull all of that out to show you guys. But this stuff is really cool. Um, this was also like, a, I think, like a dollar. I can't really remember. I've kind of been on like a little track on finding this stuff so this little bag has a bunch of allen keys um i'll probably get like a little cheap set this is like everything but this is um like a little set that i kind of just throw everywhere if i need some allen keys um but i'll probably just get like a little cheap set when they go on sale like during christmas time or something like that in here um just so it looks a lot cleaner and nice there's allen keys i do have some needle nose pliers 
these are amazing. These are, I always heard these called as carpenter pliers. I like these. Um, yeah, so I got those. I got this bad boy. Big kahonka, little kahonka. That's everything that I have in this bad boy. I'll probably throw a couple more in here, but this is something I'm just kind of building out as I go. Um, I'll get into that one last. Let's get into this one. Okay, so on this one I do have a bigger utility knife. You never know when you might need one. I have the ratchet. This is only a 3 8 ratchet, but I do have the half inch, well one, yeah, half inch adapter and the one fourth adapter. So yeah, so I can fit all the sizes on this thing. Um, let's see what else I got here. I do have different kinds of screwdrivers, all sorts of different kinds of screwdrivers, all sorts. All sorts of screwdrivers. And I have little universal bits. I do have more bits in the little pouch, but again, when it hits Christmas time and uh, everything goes on like super sale, there's like a really nice bit set that I'm gonna buy, both for the pack that I, the, the EDC pack and this pack that has just so many bits and they're like a really good price. Um, so I'll probably buy that. That's everything in this pouch, um, except this. So I made this, and it's just a little pry bar. Just get up underneath something, pry it up, you know. It works. I mean, I've tried it a couple times, and it works, so. Um, yeah, I have some universal ones. Like I, um, for the bits, I have like this little, this little itty bitty guy, and then I have like, like this big old kahunka. But, uh, yeah. Ba, 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 ba. Let me get all these things back in here. Let me set that one off to the side. That might change this one. I like this one more. This is a little bit really beefy. Um, so I might change this out with a, maybe a little bit different one. But anyway, I'll get into the last one here. This has a lot of just a lot of everything. So, in this pouch, I have, oh man. Oh yeah. Yeah, in this pouch. So this is the duct tape pouch I made, and I have like Gorilla, tape, this is regular duct tape, I have a lot of masking tape, different kinds of masking tape, and a lot more of the uh, electrical tape. Man, you just never know when you need any of this stuff, but I also don't want to carry like a huge roll or all sorts of different color rolls. So this definitely works, you'll probably get the job done in a pinch. So that's definitely why I made this. Um, but yeah. Just a little pouch, you know, just in case if I ever need any more duct tape or anything, I could shove all the rest of them in here. Then I have... Can't remember what gauge wire this is, but some wire. Here's a lighter. Fire. Here's a lock. And it has the code on the back. I'm not going to show you the code just because you never know. But this is a lock that I have the code taped to the back that I could just rip off if I ever need to lock anything. And then I have little zip ties, I have big zip ties, and I have two different other kinds of wires. So yeah, that's everything I'm keeping in this pack for right now. Um, I'll probably put more in here, take away a little bit, just kind of 
here and there while I'm at, uh, for a little bit, like maybe when a tool deal goes up, I'm like, ooh, I could definitely put that in here. I'll definitely will because, you know, I'm a, I'm a broke boy. Um, I have, I have two kids. Um, so I'm, I'm a broke boy. Um, but yeah, this is definitely a pack that I'm going to keep in the car or keep in this backpack in the car just if I ever need to like run away or anything and ditch my car for whatever reason. But yeah, I, I would definitely recommend if you want to keep some tools in your car, um, definitely recommend like maybe finding some pouches. Like this is like a filled pouch from, uh, man, what was this from? I can't remember. Something was in here that like broke forever ago, but I kept the pouch. Um, then you can get these like clear, like full clear pencil pouches for like a buck, two bucks. And you can get like these, you know, like cloth ones for like a buck. I would totally recommend getting these. The one thing is I may not keep them in here um, forever. I may switch this up, but keep all this in there, you know? I don't know. Um, I can definitely tell you, I do like pouches more like this um, that have individual, like, holders, you know? Just so you could, if you need to, you could, like, be like, oh, crap, I need to ditch all of this. I'm gonna take a little bit of everything. You can make this even small, like, all this even smaller and just take, like, what you absolutely have to and run away. Um, but yeah, yeah. I would totally recommend getting different kinds of pouches, kind of save some, whatever, just in case, you know, you want to build something like this. This alleviates so much noise. Holy cow. Like, before I looked at that thing, it just rattled with metal. Now, I could, like, shake the whole thing, and I don't, and it's not going to rattle. I'll do this. Well. Let's put everything back in here. And I'll give it a good rattle. Hold on. Okay, I'm going to zip it close for you guys. Like, you can hear it, but, like, it's not what it used to be, you know? But, yeah, totally. I'm proud of this thing. But I just wanted to show you guys what I was... What I've kind of been up to, um, and everything what's kind of on my mind for everything but yeah um i do have another video for a pack that goes in here and in the backpack i am making for just my edc because they both kind of they correlate together you'll see um but yeah anyways thank you guys for watching don't forget to like and subscribe um and a lot of you that are watching these videos aren't subscribed like i think it's like a like 60 to 40 ratio. So 60 people, 60% 60 of you guys who are watching this video aren't subscribed. Maybe, maybe just consider subscribing. I don't know. You never know what you're going to tune into. Like you could probably, I guess, get an idea of like, oh, he's probably making something like this. So he's probably going to do a couple more videos. But then after that, you're like, what is he going to do? What is he going to get into? I don't know. So definitely stay for the weirdest trip ever, guys. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. And as always, don't forget to do something good for someone else, you know. Hold the door open for someone, you know. Help someone walk across the road. Carry someone's groceries out to their car. I don't know. I don't really care. Do something good for someone else. And as always, see you guys later.